up guys welcome back to the channel i'm over here at long key i'm just walking up to pretty much where i think i'm gonna fish i'm walking up to where i think i'm gonna fish i see some tarpon rolling around around here already see a little bit of seaweed i think it was a full moon last night i'm not sure how that's gonna affect everything i feel like somewhere in between that railing and this railing is where i got that mutton last time so I'm not sure. I'm going to be fishing around this area. Let's get it going. I have a lot of bait this morning. I have goggle eyes. I have ballyhoo. I have frozen shrimp. I have live shrimp. Let's get it going, guys. I actually even put a brand new line on this reel. I'm ready to go. I've never even seen a permit in real life. That was not a jack. Hey guys, I'm going with this chunk of mullet, 5 volt hook, 30 pound fluorocarbon. Got a three ounce egg weight, 25 pound pink Andes mono. Got a long leader out there. Long leader out there. I'm keep my line tight for my bait runner. I'm gonna wait for that mutton. Let me try to get that line a little tighter. There we go. Wait for that mutton, guys. Here we go, guys. I'm on. First fish of the day, guys. Feels like a nice uh, yellow jack. Or a decent size of mutton. What do you guys think I got? Can anybody call it? Anybody call this big fish? That's rushing me over here. <laughs> a mudding. Got a mudding, guys. Oh, they're here again. What was I doing? Oh, I was trying to take off that needle fish. First mudding of the day, got hooked on a 5 0. Stinking ass. Okay. Helping you out here. First one of the day is a 16 incher. Thanks for the catch, buddy. I'm retying the hook because it's got to be perfect, guys. Oh, but I got it, guys. I got a little net here, but I'm not really too used to the net. I feel like I grab them faster without the net. But for pinfish, yeah, those guys are spiky as hell. Ah. Look at this. Can you be a keeper, bro? Stop playing. Stop playing. No. A little freaking yellowtail eats a giant piece of mullet. Cuño. Look at that little 11 inch, y'all. <laughs> bye bye, buddy. Look at this gog out there. Or this chunk of gog. Tail out there. Look at all those fish. What are those black fish? Wonder if I should. Oh, okay. Oh, gotta get something in here today. Look at this little looky. Key West looky. Or Florida Keys looky. Y'all, I know. Oh, 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 sorry, sorry. I know there's bigger ones out there, so I thought I was on. I thought I was 
is on, dog. What is it, mutton? Another mutton. We have mutton number two coming in at 16. 16. Mutton number two at 16. Uh, I was able to get a nice hook set on this one. Is uh, that mutton, guys? Whoop. See ya. Work on my camera angles, guys. Sometimes I'm editing my video and I'm like, damn, you can't even see the fish. I know it frustrates some people. I'm trying. Just so locked in trying to get that keeper two inches away. Got a yellow jack, guys. Look at this. I knew there were yellow jacks, yo. Look at that, little yellow jack. That's a baby. So I'm gonna throw him back because I know some people abuse out here. They keep everything. But that is a delicious fish, guys. Beautiful yellow jack. I'm just gonna keep the big ones, man. Some people, they abuse out here. It's an unregulated species and it's delicious. Biting these big old, um, these big old hooks, these little yellow tails. Come on, buddy. Let's measure you first, little baby boy. How big are you? You are almost 11. I tried, buddy. Sorry, bud. Alright. A little mangrove on a dumper shrimp. What the heck? That's different. You're just over 10. This guy's ten and a half, and he spiked the hell out of me. So you know what that means. He's coming home. Switching up the bait, guys. I'm trying to see what works here. I'm gonna go with this big old with this big old piece of valley. Got one guys, I got one. On a whole valley hoop y'all. Got one. Feels like another 16 inch though. Damn, what do I gotta do for the 20s boy? What does one gotta do for the 20s? Chad, a whole entire body hook. I got you hooked on the side nicely. Alrighty, check it out, guys. Another mudding. How's my angle? Let me see. Another mudding, guys. Let's check this one out. We have, this one looks like a 15 and a half. -er. Oh, he's about to be 15. All right, buddy. Thank you for not flopping too crazy. Oh.
a big one guys is that it did i get him hey net fuck i'm gonna need some help guys oh uh, tell me this is a shark Yo! Let's see if those guys come over here and help me out. I'm gonna need the net. I'm, yeah, I might need to, your help if I could get them. The net's already untangled. Thank you, brother. Appreciate it. This might be a damn uh, nurse though. Let me give him some. In between two pilings and under the bridge. I know where he's going. He's, he's trying to bust a damn left on my ass. Thank you, brother. I'm trying to keep it from rubbing on that bridge, but I've done this before. Six in the morning. Six, six a.m. What was in the water at six? Huh? What was in the water at six? Yeah, yeah, yeah. The first catch or anybody else? No, no, I got like uh, three uh, muttons that were nice. One was 16 and a half, two were 16. A couple of, uh, they gotta be 18. Got three yellow tails. They were like from 10 and a half to 11. I got a yellow jack, but I threw him back, but he was like 12 inches. That you could keep them, but I, I, you know, I want to keep the bigger ones. And I look down that I threw them back. They're here. Damn, dog. It's a weird angle. Yeah, I'm trying to tire his ass out. You see that, that line by to touch that bridge? I think I'm going to go. It's crazy how the garage can bend like that. Oh, yeah. It's an ugly stick, baby. He's running though. Come on, baby. Where you going? When I get him tired, I could bring him in, but I'm already rubbing. I'm already rubbing. All right. I'm already rubbing, dog. Look at this, y'all. These guys came to save my ass over here. I'm pretty sure I got a nurse. Uh, I'm gonna try to start getting his ass. You got him? Yeah, I'm pretty sure it's a monster jack or a little nurse. Uh, how, how you feeling? Look at that sea turtle right there. Oh, yeah, I see sea turtle. Or, I'm not so sure. You just feel like a powerful fish. Like yes. All right, let me see. But he is a heavy fish. He is way out there. I'm gonna have to tire him. It's gonna be a long fight, though. I've lost enough fish. Sometimes you gotta lose fish to learn how to catch fish. I've lost a lot of damn fish. You start cranking right here, you start tightening the drag, you gonna pop it. I just put this line yesterday. I've been down to nothing on this reel though. What's messing me up is that bridge. This is the technique. You see this technique right here? Oh, let's go, baby. Oh, that's a big, that's a nurse shark. No, hell no. Oh, you mean like handlining them? You will have to handline them from down here. That is a, that is a nurse shark. I think this is a nurse shark. All right, start coming. There we go. He's starting to get tired. Let's go, let's go. This is a damn mutton snapper, bro. This is a damn shark. See them tarping out there? Start getting some line back. Ah. Come on, start coming this way, baby. Leverage. This 
this is when the longer pole comes in handy. Leverage, baby, leverage. Put this shit brand new. Now he's making a right. Oh uh, yeah, you'll get better. You just gotta watch some, watch the right guys like Chad. Chad and Seaweed. I learned so much from those two guys, bro. Shark in with Seaweed. You gotta check it out. He got on a rock or he's just tired as hell right now. Nah, he's he's on. He's on. I mean I just need to get like a medium rod because I have a big one and a small one. I only catch stuff my big ones. Now you see how many rods I have is still not enough. I'm here. Look at that turtle just watching the show, bro. <laughs> I'm telling you, if this wasn't, if this isn't a nurse shark dog, I'm very surprised. I've caught so many. Yeah. Yeah, buddy. He's got a little tire. You just gotta let his ass run. Yo, hit the bottom. Yo, hey, it's, you just got it. Once you figure it out, you got it. Just let, let the, look. That shit hits the bottom. Jerk, jerk, jerk. The wind is killer today, dog. The, nah, it's a fake shrimp. That's, it's, a, it's called a thumper shrimp. Nah, the wind today is out of control, dog. I got one snapper today on that. Right here by the chum bag, just doing that same shit. One keeper mangrove. See, I finally got to out through the bridge, dog. Thank God. Woo! Andy's 25 pound line. This is some great line. Which ones? Uh, oh, rainbow parrotfish. Damn, now he's making a turn. Where you going, Papa? Got one? Yeah, dog. They do that. They do that. The hook set. A yellow? I see them down there. I've seen the yellow jacks down there, bro. Big old yellow jacks. They're down there. I got one more chum block. I'm gonna drop it before I clear. Yeah, yeah. That's it. Is. I can come over here if you want to. You come over here. I got another chum block I'm about to put down. It's gonna turn up. Yeah, I wanna come over here. It's all good. Damn, brother, this this is a. Oh, I see it. I see it. You good? You good? All right, I got him under the bridge. Let me skate over here. I'm gonna do it. Uh, yeah. I must see if I can try to get his ass. Yeah, I'm calling big ass Jack or Nurse Shark. Next time he get tired, I'm gonna start bringing in line. I was down to nothing. I got a lot of line back. Come on. This way, baby, this way. No. 
getting tired though oh what was that is that what i got no no that's tarpon ain't no way i got a damn tarpon i don't think tarpon eat dead bait i had an oh i had an entire dead fish I just put this line last night. I'm already gonna have to switch my line. Come on, partner. Oh, where are you going? Where are you going? Bigger reel. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. What you got? Probably a big ass catfish. Catfish? Shark? Yeah. <laughs> Probably a big kitty cat. I've been on here for a while with this damn fish. Hey, are you on, um, what's it called? Captain Snook? Is that your name? Captain Snook. I don't know what they call him Captain Snook. One of these guys follows me on my YouTube channel for a while. His name's Captain Snook. I thought you were him. I remember he was my 41st subscriber. I'm, metic I'm meticulous like that. I'm at like 2,000 now. Oh yeah. You're getting tired, mama. Tired, yeah, bro. I feel him. Tired, bro. <laughs> this little 8,000 bay runner feels like a little bait reel right now. <laughs> I yelled at these guys and I thought I had a nice mutt and now I don't even know how to do. Don't go back to the other side. You're killing me. On the other side, I was down to no line. I had no line left. Just put this line yesterday. I feel like we're getting close now. He's still down there. He's down, down, down on the bottom. Oh no, don't get hung up. There we go. Up top, baby. Thank you, partner. This is a long battle right here. I'm just giving them some drag. Yeah, yeah. Just trying to give them a foot every time I take three or four I give them a foot so I don't want to straighten out my hook or pop my line I know I've rubbed on the bridge a few times so that 
turtle's been watching the whole time. Look at, look, look at my rod. He's trying to go down, down, down. That's a turtle, that's a turtle out there. No. Oh no, there's tarp in here all the morning. I don't think. Yeah, yeah, they call it a tail walk. He's trying to go way back out there again. Now, he doesn't like this bridge. Oh, that's a big fish, man. Submarine down there, brother. Oh, that's not me. That's a big tarpon over there. Okay, he coming up. Oh, he coming in, yo. I'm getting him closer. What do we got? to know that's about 12 feet how many feet you'd say that is the work in on all right you could break me off now papa i don't know he's in a there you go right there
snapper? Uh, 10 inches. It's like 12. I'll come right now to you. You got stuck? Yo, cut that shit. Come over here. I'm gonna put something else on your line. Cut that shit. That shit was driving me crazy what you had. So put a jig head on. I've been watching Chad, though. This is a loop, loop knot. Yeah, Carolina, but right now with the seaweed and the bullshit, and we're not casting very far right now. Right now, you're just gonna cast over here to get you some snappers. A loop knot? So you did a loop knot. I'll show you why it's called a loop knot. So you just make this little circle, put that thing in here. This is just called a jig head. When you get jig heads, just get white or green. Those two colors. And then buy all kinds of sizes because it all depends on the damn weather. One, two, three. And wet it and put it right back through that circle. Mm -hmm. All right. Okay. And the reason I did the loop here, I'll show you. If you tie that shit too tight, it kind of moves like this. But now with the loop, it's gonna move more naturally. Right. You use loop knots for jig heads and shit like that, and like the thumper shrimp. Now here, you're just gonna hook it like I told you and drop it right down there and get you a snapper. It shouldn't take you too long. They're pulling up now because the chum. When this one runs out, I'll drop my last chum block. They're coming up to the top, top, top. That's crazy. Never seen that before. Or I guess once it goes under the bridge, they don't see me. And then they hit it. split shot and a number six long shank and I think I'm gonna hook that bad boy just like this the this, split shot just holds it where it is yeah the split shot is just gonna weigh it down because if I throw it it's gonna just float crazy you split shot. You just no you saw how I just I put it on and I bit it with my teeth uh, and to take it off you just pinch it here with your pliers oh, shit, that's pretty fun. yeah you put them on and off however you like uh, they're kind of they're convenient and then for the mangroves, you see they already on them. They already on his ass. This is a super lightweight rod. This is my daughter's rod. Oh, okay. What's up? Should I stop it on mine? Hell yeah. Wait, no, but you got a jig head? No. You're good on the jig yeah, head. Yeah, hey, you got They're kind of big boys. I actually have some. Oh, if you do a Carolina rig with the two ounce right now, it would be fire. Hell yeah. Where they at? Oh, oh my god. I just saw a yellow jack, bro. There's a baby yellow tail. <laughs> Little baby. My wife loves yellow tail snappers. Yeah, buddy. Ooh, get back there. Bye bye, buddy. <laughs> a little uh, 10 incher so that worked all right i can't believe there's yellow jacks like right here though okay damn bro they're liking this rig 
with the with the launch tank. Ooh, ooh, ooh. Little ass fish. You're about nine, huh? You're about a niner. Look at that, guys. The mangrove snapper right here. This is exactly 10 inches. He's legal. Oh, wow. Problem is, he's going to shrink a quarter inch on the ice. Mm -hmm. And I'm going to let him go. I've heard that thing a lot. <laughs> I'm going to let him go. I'm going to get back after another one. snapper some are red some are um a little more redder some are more white oh shit here we go oh 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 oh, oh. what is that dude oh no I never caught a pair of fish before hey hold my fishing rod please there's a crappy uh reel walmart reel <laughs> now, these things are protected, but I hear they taste like lobster. Look at that, guys! Rainbow parrotfish. Not pretty. Pretty fish, man. That looks just like a parrot. Look at that, guys. <laughs> oh, my bad, dude. <laughs> <laughs> I, I hear they eat those in the Bahamas because you're allowed to and that they taste like love so I'm dying to try one bro. If I, if I go to the Bahamas that's what I want to eat. He's actually small for a pair of fish. Let's see how big he is. We got a almost 15 incher. All right, I'm gonna give you a fish kiss. Oh, Woo! I thought he was coming to my face with that, with that snout. They eat coral and stuff. I see why they call it a pair. Yeah. Like oh, I won't give you a kiss and throw you back. You got like my lucky kiss. He don't like me getting close to him. Oh, oh, oh! It was just a kiss. Damn. Some little things are pulling up. Oh, I got a pork fish. A pork fish. Aquarium fish. Pork. Like pork? Yeah, pork fish. Can't keep these. I have no idea. I just looked it up one day. A little pork fish. They got meat on them. Well, he was back. There's a school of something that just showed up. I wonder what those are. They're all over this little pile today. keepers we might have to just throw bigger baits bro oh, 
You got teeth, hold on. No, my little, little. Bye bye. Check it out. Center. I pop that thing out so that it's like this and I'm just gonna drop them but you can't have a lot of slack in your line you're, you're feeling everything through the through the tension and the tip of the rod all right y'all I need two more mangroves I need two more mangroves and I got my limit I'm trying to get at right now. Huh? What was that? How many have so far? Uh, three. You can take five. We've, got, we've gotten like six yellow tails, there's no keepers, bro. I am dog. That's some good eating fish right there. for good luck just watch out with the mangroves those things bite uh, so you took my bait from the tail you know what it is they're seeing my hook there's hey those are yellow jacks yeah Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yellowtail is a yellowtail snapper. Yellow Jack is a, a yellow jack, like from the Jack family. But it's the best tasting jack. And they don't have a limit. They don't have a limit, so you can just keep it whatever you catch. But you really, you don't want to keep like the small ones. I caught one that was like probably 12 or 13, I threw them back. Let's go, baby. Ooh. A little yellow tail. A little baby tail. Oh, oh. I almost got a spike, buddy. Sorry. Another one. Pork, pork fish. Yep. Fudge. I want that mangrove, bro. I want him. Yeah, he's like only swimming in this little part. Then there's big jack over there. Swimming around and around. Oh, man, this guy's like 11. Yeah. He's like 11. I saw a yellow tail. Damn, I gotta chum one more. Hey, I've gotten a lot of yellow tails today. Right, where's he at? I see him right there. Let's go, buddy. Be the one to take the shrimp. Let's go. Oh, oh, oh. 
not getting the fish that I'm after. I'm getting a lot of fish. I'm get I'm catching a lot of fish, but not the one that I'm after. Yeah, bro. I am not after this fish. Beautiful fish, man. I see the, the mangrove swimming around and around. It's like 14 inches at least. The birds, they're trying to pull up on my, my shrimp right here. Look, yeah, look. <laughs> twinsies. <laughs> Get out my bucket, fish. You can't come with me. What a pretty fish, bro. What's that, like 102, 103? <laughs> How does that? Mr. Tail, <laughs> not the keeper. Think he's touching 12? Guys, though, thank you for helping me out. Good luck to you guys, bro. All day, I ain't quitting. Hell no, it only gets better from here. Yeah, it's 305 Florida boy. Yeah, Ooh. I started like 11 months ago. Last week I got monetized. So now I start making a little money. You know, and I could throw more money in. Maybe rent a boat, fish a reef. I want to do like spear fishing, all that, bro. All everything like that. All right, guys, I'm gonna wrap it up here. Another great trip at Long Key. I was able to get four keeper mangrove snappers, and I threw one back that was ten on the money. I didn't want to take them home because I didn't want them to shrink up. You know how that goes. But I'll show you guys what I caught now in a minute. Take a look at the scenery, y'all. It's beautiful. We got an outgoing tide now. It'll be a nice little sunset later. We're gonna go ahead and call it for today. As always, thank you guys for tuning in. Thank you everybody for subscribing, liking, and sharing. And I'll see you guys in the next one. Check it out, guys. Four little mangs. Almost cut the limit out here.